Hello everyone and welcome back to the World Cup of Wrestling! And Will Ospreay has it all to do here today. And he needs help elsewhere as well. If he wants to stand any chance of qualifying. But first things first for him, he needs to defeat Mark Andrews as England takes on Wales. Alright then, so basically Will Ospreay needs to win this match here against Mark Andrews. And then he also needs Kurt Angle to defeat the Iron Sheik later on. If that does happen, then we will trigger a triple threat match. And the winner of that triple threat match will go through second in the group. And that will be Iron Sheik, Mark Andrews and Will Ospreay. So it's all to do here for, uh, for Will Ospreay. He needs, basically needs to pull out the best performance so far for him in this tournament. And he needs the other match to go his way as well. So yeah. It's going to be very, very difficult for Mark to qualify. Uh, not Mark. If Mark Andrews wins this, by the way, I think he will qualify. Yes. If Mark Andrews wins this match, he will qualify, no matter what happens between the Iron Sheik and... Oh, mate. Uh, oh, actually, no. If Mark Andrews wins this... So the only way we're not going to get a triple threat on this uh, is if... Um, if Kurt Angle defeats the Iron Sheik... That's the only way we're not going to end up with a triple threat for either first or second place. So yeah, I mean, nobody's guaranteed at this point in time. This group is incredibly open. As a single leg Boston Crab here by Mark Andrews. I mean, if Will Ospreay does qualify for the next round, he will have done it the bloody hard way, I tell you. And of course, we already know the uh, the matches that this group will end up in against. I can't remember what they are now, though. Uh, I can have a look. It is... So the winner of the group will take on the Sultan, representing Qatar. And second place in the group will take on Malachi Black, representing the Netherlands in the knockout stages. And when you get to the knockout stages... It is what it is, isn't it? It's all about just, um... It's one match to prove yourself. If you lose that match, if you don't turn up for one match, you're out, and that's it. As, oh, turning... Talk about not turning up at all. Will Ospreay struggling there once again. Uh, Mark Andrews has had a very good tournament, to be honest. And, like I said, if Mark Andrews wins here, and if, uh... Kurt Angle wins later on. Then Mark Andrews does go through in this group in second position. Andrews now brings Osprey back up. Springs off the ropes. Captured into the Bulldog. Andrews now heading up to the top. And in with that big shooting star. Lovely. There's the pin for the one, the two. Oh my god, how close was that to a freak out? Almost. And I say we can confirm here at the end of this match if if Andrews loses or if Andrews wins, sorry, we can confirm that Osprey is out no matter what. And that would be a surprise. One of the potential favourites being eliminated this early on would be a massive surprise. I mean, we've already seen it. We've already seen that Claudio Castagnoli is already eliminated. Which, again, was a massive surprise. One of the favourites to win the entire tournament. Be interesting to see who does come out on top of this tournament now, to be honest. As it's now Osprey up on top. Stalking the grounded Mandrews. And Osprey misses the dropkick. Well done, mate. Osprey with the backbreaker. Now going to head up onto the top. Stalking the grounded Mandrews once again. Osprey. Is he going to go for inverted 450? I think he just about got some of Mark Andrews. It might be enough to finish him off. Oh, it's not though. It's only a two count still. And remember, like I said... If uh, Osprey does win this, he needs a Kurt Angle win in the final match of this group to stand chance of going through still. If Iron Sheik picks up the victory, then it's done and dusted anyway. Mandrew's now in with a standing moonsault, a standing shooting star. 
drops into the pin. Will this be enough for Mandrews to pick up the win? It is! Oh my god, Will Ospreay. How have you been so bad in this tournament, Will? I really... I, you know what? I was going to go for the British Bulldog, and I bloody well should have done, because he would have done a much better job. Will Ospreay loses again, which means he has had five matches so far this year, and Will Ospreay has lost them all. He has had an absolutely shocking 2022 in SWE. But Mark Andrews on the other side, he picks up his second victory. And Mark Andrews now knows that he is in with a chance. If Kurt Angle wins our match later on, then Mark Andrews will qualify. If Iron Sheik defeats Kurt Angle then it will go to a triple threat to decide who will qualify for the next round of matches. But either way, Mark Andrews is in this one, and Will Ospreay is not. England are eliminated. Shock. Shocking. Terrible.